Coming up this week on Beeman's Archer's Choice. Featuring North America's favorite hunting couple. This is the Archer's Choice. Oh, mine's perfect. No, mine's perfect. I think you're, no, I think yours is a little wrong. No. Welcome to the Archer's Choice. This week, even though we're standing out here and we're bundled up because we're cold it's and we're back chilly. at home. It's chilly. But this week we're going down to Florida with Uncle Hoppy yep. and Osceola Outfitters. That's it. Mm -hmm. And we're going for our, for our Osceola Gobblers. Right. The redheads. Those miserable feathered things that just. You don't like turkeys. No, I don't. I really Give me don't. Give a relationship to them. This first part, what we're going to do is we're just going to go into and we're going to show some encounters of, of Ralph and and you had you had a pretty busy day with all those birds walking through. So let's just get the footage rolling. Well, we're back down here again with Hoppy Kemp for it. Osceola Outfitters down in Florida. It's the first run of the turkey season. It's been about. 85 degrees. It's rough because we left what in the pajamas? 40s? Yeah, 40s. It's been miserable. We're here with Pat. We're here with Travis. We're in the big house blind and you want to know why they call it the big house? It's a big house. Rock a bye, baby, in the blind. Oh, I guess that'd be a blind, wouldn't it? Things didn't go exactly how we planned. Uh, birds didn't cooperate today, and they're surely not talking. Stick around, Archer's Choice. We'll be back in two minutes. Welcome back to the Archer's Choice. Have you ever had one of them gobblers just stand out there all day long and just not break that 40 yard mark or even closer than that? Watch this footage.
just good enough to get him. He came a long way. No, oh, I know. Just got him right, right there. Yeah, he wouldn't break that. We that needed 40, another 10 yards. Yeah, he wouldn't break that 40 yard mark. That's on. Yeah. I mean, he stayed here, what, 45 minutes within 100 yards yeah. of us? Yeah, we've got like 40 minutes of tape of him just strutting goblin, but. Check out this encounter with Ralph and this limpy bird. I think Hoppy put Ralph in this blind on purpose. He knew that bird was a little slower. Maybe Ralph would have a little better chance. Close, but no cigar. Did I ever tell you I hate gobblers? Now it's Freddy's turn to go for his Now, baby. Yes! 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 Ooh, yes! Ooh! Yes, sir! Ooh, baby! Ooh. Holy right? smokes, I'm okay! Get over yourself, man. <laughs> he didn't go very far, did he, Hoppy? No, maybe 20 yards. 30 with the little hook he made. I think it's a little more. Yep, he's a boar. Yep. He's a boar. Got little tuskers. Tusk oh, wow. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Yeah. Boy, you, pounder. you guys got the hogs hog. down here, don't you? Oh, yeah. We've Hoppy. Been, been looking around, hadn't seen any all yep. afternoon. And bam, here they are in this little, little corner rye field right here on this food plot. Holy <laughs> smoke. What are you thinking? Now, what if I would have crossed you? Hey, welcome back to the Archer's Choice. 
if you just saw Freddie waylaid, waylaid on a hog. Yeah. Yeah? That wasn't proper etiquette. What do you mean? You crossed in front of me with your Vicky, arrow. Vicky, it is closer to bear season than it is caribou season. Now, come on. You know that. We need to your practice. Your philosophy our... amazes me. Oh my gosh. I can't even, I can't even fight with that one. That's Thank just you. See? hysterical. Cause, Cause you know I'm right. You know I'm right. No, that's now, not the point. Let's go check out my turkey hunt. Come on, it's cool. Freddie and I, we were dying of sweat in the blind together and it's a pretty cool, pretty cool, cool experience. And, and how many right. people do you know get two shots at the same bird? Only you, Vic, only you. We're set up, it's the third morning out. We're set up in the same spot that we were set up yesterday afternoon. We saw some birds, but we didn't have anything coming close enough. We've got a decoy out there on the ditch bank a little bit further, hoping that maybe if the birds are a little nervous of the decoy, they'll come and swing around closer to us rather than going out on the other side of the ditch bank. It's a lot overcast today. Yesterday it was hot and sunny. Today it's still supposed to be warm, but we got overcast. It looks like rain. Hopefully we'll get the birds coming in. She talks about me. What about monkey see, monkey do? <laughs> she slept a lot longer than I did. You missed him. <laughs> I love it. You missed him, Vic. Stay tuned. Archer's Choice will be right back. Can you believe she missed? I love this. I absolutely love when we get her on. She just threw mud at me. Can you believe she's gonna get a second shot? It ain't right.
Oh my gosh. Look at this bird. He's a beautiful, beautiful Osceola. He's got his spurs. Can you see that? <laughs> Look at this beard too. Beautiful, beautiful bird. It was kind of funny. I shot and missed him. I gotta go find that other arrow. I seem to be on that, you know, the warning shot system again. <laughs> Vic, can you believe those birds in that thunderstorm? No, that was pretty unique. I mean, those birds knew the thunder was coming. As soon as that lightning flashed, they jumped before, they sensed before it. the thunder. Yeah. They know a lot more than we do. A lot more than you do. Look at my arrows. We were in here, a torrential downpour. We had a small jake, and we had a hen. You know, when you're dealt those cards and you're like, you know, I ain't got a winning hand. I don't have a winning hand this trip, but that's cool. No, it's not. <laughs> wow. You just have issues with turkeys. I hate them. Yeah, I mean, even- I hate them. I hate turkeys. You, you know, it's kind, of, it's, it's kind of funny because that last day we're sitting there and I said, well, I'm tagged out, so I'd film you. And did, Why'd you have to say I'm tagged out? I mean, come on. I was. Nice, nice bird too, by the way. But, yeah, it took two shots. But I still have him. You know, that's okay. That's okay. And then what happens that last day? Ralph goes out there. We have thunder and lightning. There's like hurricane weather coming through. We did. And those birds, those you know what's really cool? Those birds just stand there. They just stand. <laughs> hey, like, we, what's we got, the matter with We got our mad dog rain gear on. We're okay. And, and, <laughs> I mean, it and, was and amazing. And I was pretty happy. We were in the blind. The only problem was is it did drip and I fried one of the camera screens. Yeah, that was really good. Oops, $600 later. It happens. That, that's one of those things when you're filming. It happens. But, I mean, come on. Freddie shot an awesome hog. Yeah, you, had, you did have a lot of encounters, and I mean, you had a lot of encounters with Jake's, and I know, you know, down there at Hoppies, he really wants to take mature yep. birds, and so we're waiting for him, and I mean, at least you didn't shoot and miss one this year. That's a good thing. Well, you did. But I had him. He came back. It was well, a Vicky, warning shot. The thing Don't is, you know about my warning shots? When you when you surround a bird with arrows, he can't no, really go anywhere, I so shot, you might as well just center the, the circle I and get him. I shot one and hit a feather. Hey, we hope you enjoyed this dead. week's show, because uh, I'm, I'm out of here. I just can't handle Whatever. this anymore. We would like you to come back next week, same time. Same channel. Right here on, on the, the Archer's, Archer's Choice. Choice.